Oh hey guys, just a quick video before I go to bed. You know, I've been thinking recently, it is actually very possible to play the game for free if you want to, without doing too much work. So, at the moment, for about 7,600, you can actually buy a WoW token, which gives you 30 days of gameplay, which is kind of not too expensive in a way. Um, I mean, it's a good sum of money, sure, but it only works out to about 250 gold per day that you need to sort of save in an account somewhere. Maybe you have like one character where you save all your money and yeah, you can buy 30 days game time, which I think is pretty cool. So I can actually make the whole 250 gold just with two professions, which I've leveled to max. So for a start for mining, these um, Titan Steel bars are going for about 185 gold and they're quite expensive to make i would say they are about um, 70 or 80 gold to make but if you farm a lot some of the materials yourself you can actually um obviously produce a lot of these things for free and you know you can also sell the additional ores and stuff that you get for extra money uh the other thing that's doing really good is i've got a transmute and that's on my alchemist on my mage and they can basically create a cardinal ruby and at the moment these rubies are going for about 300 gold as you guys can see here the materials for the cardinal mute ruby transmute you need your standard red um, crystal which goes for about 60 gold and then you just need an elemental fire which you can farm yourself or they're going for about 30 to 50 gold which is actually a lot of money considering you can farm these things in probably, I don't know, five minutes each or something. It's certainly very possible that just from two professions, and that's without any questing or anything else, you can just raise the 7,600 amount that you need. Now, also, the funny thing is, I just heard about a guy who bought about five years game time because he saved up so much money in Classic. He just thought, yeah, I'm going to, like by five years of game time which is absolutely insane and i've actually got um a friend in the guild who just bought a whole year's worth of wow tokens basically yeah he had a lot of money again probably much better at making money than me i think he does dailies every day which again are a great way of making money i also don't know for sure but i've heard you can make pretty good money if you just do the um argent tournament uh, quests, but I haven't really got into that myself. A world token actually costs about seventeen pounds at the moment. So, for example, if we click here and go to the shop, yeah, seventeen pounds for seven thousand six hundred gold. So it's quite a lot of British pounds, I suppose. But again, everyone's financial circumstances are different, and you know, some people would rather just pay seventeen pounds than sort of farm the gold themselves. Obviously, I think game time's cheaper than that by quite a bit anyway. I should also mention that um, the game time applies for both Classic as well as Retail. So, But one of the easy things you could actually do if you wanted to is just do a few um, GDKPs. So here we go. I've just opened up my group finder here. We've got this GDKP. Um, it's an 80-20 split. Some of these GDKPs, I've seen them selling trophies for 2,000, for example. I've even seen the trophies going for as high as 6,000. Again, a lot of the items in there cost several thousand in the GDKPs. So, yeah, when you get your 80% um, split, I'm not saying that you could buy like a whole month, but, you know, if you do two or three GDKPs per month, then um, you probably raise the amount of money that you need for the month to continue playing the game. So there is another way of making money. Um, currently, if I go to my character, go to currency, you guys will see I have 133 emblems of conquest. I've also got 33 emblems of valor. And all of these are basically um, worthless at this point because there's nothing I can really buy with these things. Or is there? There are lots of items that you can buy in the game and convert them into cash. Now, you can actually go to the black market underground and you can convert all your emblems into emblems of heroism, right? So, I would say um, 100, 160, let's say. So, I could buy 16 
um, Amorites for that price. Let's go see how much these uh, Amorites are going for. The Amorite... Oh, I need to delete the um, brackets. Yeah, so the Amorites are going for 190 gold. Obviously on the auction house nothing is guaranteed. So I've just done the math. Just converting that would get me 3,000 gold um, based on these prices. Okay, the prices vary a little bit. But yeah, I mean, we more or less get um, 3,000 gold. So that's actually halfway, you know, towards getting a WoW token, pretty much. Which, you know, isn't bad. It's probably loads of old um, tokens you can trade in on your different characters to raise money. It's also um, another really good way of earning money. It's just doing the daily every day. And obviously, any extra materials that you get, you can sort of trade in or sell or whatever. Alternately, I'm not saying this is um, a good use of your precious emblems of triumph. I also have um, ruined orbs. Which, again, I could buy a shed load of, which are selling for about 18 gold. Uh, sorry, 250 gold. 